Hey guys, it's Dan O'Donnell at PositiveAtmosphere.com. I want to do a quick video with a few tips for you today. Uh, I plan to start doing videos more consistently. I haven't been doing many here for a while. But anyway, today I want to talk quickly about a couple things. One is um, music. I'm kind of a music addict. Uh, I pretty much always have it going when I'm working. It helps me just keep moving and keep calm and also avoid distractions. My mind, I don't think, it doesn't wander as much if I have some music going. Um, but I've found that certain kinds of music help me focus more. Um, chill Step is something that a friend of mine just told me about here a few months ago, and it really works for me. A lot of people, when you say Chill Step, they think Dubstep. Um, it's very different, much more mellow than Dubstep. Um, it's a combination of like the chill out lounge type of music that you might have heard um, and step music. So anyway, uh, Dubstep is a type of step. Chill step is not a type of dubstep. I actually read that on Wikipedia. So anyway, um, check out chill step, but a couple tips for you. One, I've been using YouTube a lot, almost exclusively lately, to listen to music. <clears throat> and the key is, you know, with Pandora and a lot of other services like that, you get a lot of commercials playing, which, you know, they have to make money. I understand that, especially if you're not paying for the product. But uh, it just breaks my concentration and just kind of irritates me. So on YouTube, if you put the word mix on a search, so say that you like chill step like I do, you search chill step mix. If you put that word mix on there, you're going to get a whole bunch of results that are like an hour or two hours long. <clears throat> Some of them might only be 20 minutes or something. But what I'm getting at is if you queue up a few videos that are two hours long, you know, you can do quickly have your whole work day of music planned out. And you've only got a few chances for a commercial to even come up in between videos. So um, I, you just get into that flow, and it's one mix instead of a bunch of different songs, you know, with different moods um, that can throw you off a little bit. It, if it's a two-hour mix, you know, that DJ is putting it together in a way that flows, and it just helps me out a lot. So you can do that with any kind of music, you know, 90s rock mix, um, Christmas music mix, at the, which is cool around the holidays. It just saves a lot of messing around and uh, looking for music and building playlists and stuff. And I actually built myself a playlist. Um, you can probably find it if you search them. But I think it's just called Chill Step Mix. Um, it's my playlist of Chill Step Mixes. So I've got like 20 videos that are an hour or longer. So I can literally just have that go for an entire day without hearing the same song twice. Um, another tip for you, if you do like the web-based music players, like a lot of people these days, they are either still on Pandora or they're on Spotify. And there was one that came out in between those guys that I thought was really overlooked, and it's Groove Shark. The reason I like Groove Shark as opposed to Spotify is there's no download. Groove Shark is entirely browser-based. So um, you can just go to it from any device you're on and log in, and there's all your music without kind of downloading anything um, to your friend's computer or whatever. And um, Groove Shark, the way that it really well, the, here's the thing. It's like Spotify in that you can save all your tracks and play them in whatever order you want, build playlists, save your favorites, and all that. But um, it's also like Pandora because you can just hit a uh, station and just let it play. So you don't have to build your playlist and all that. Anyway, check out Groove Shark. I recommend it. But I've, I used to use Groove Shark all day, every day, and now I'm pretty much on YouTube with these mixes, which I love. And you can even search, you know, just for mixes that came out in the last week or month or day. So you're always getting new stuff. Um, also on YouTube, check out audiobooks. It seems like more and more I'm finding full-length audiobooks on YouTube. Um, and you'll see if you do a search for, you know, take The Power of Now as an example, which is an Eckhart Tolle book. If you do The Power of Now full audio or The Power of Now audiobook, or even Power of Now Part 1. Um, those are the three ways that I've found most likely to find the audiobook. There are a bunch of books that are in the public domain that were written far enough back that it's totally legal to listen to them. There's no copyright. Um, and then, of course, there are a lot out there that are still copyrighted, but they're on YouTube. So I'm going to leave that up to you ethically, uh, what you want to do there. But there are tons of books available that way. Um, and it's cool. You don't even have to download it. You can just stream it. You can also send it to friends if it's a book you really like, which I've been doing lately. So um, enjoy that, and I will quit rambling here. It's almost five minutes in. Hope to see you at PositiveAtmosphere.com. It's a community of people helping to inspire and empower each other through blogs, videos, photos, 
forum discussions. Um, and of course, you can find us on Facebook as well. Our main page there is called Positive Thinking. So it's facebook.com slash positive atmosphere. That's our positive thinking page. Hope to see you guys. Thanks a lot. Take care.